What's up everyone? This is Eddie here. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. I hope you guys are doing good and today I'm here with one more Nepali metal band and this time it's Antim Grahan. Uh, I think I pronounced it correctly, yeah? Antim Grahan and the, the song that I'm going to check out it's Forever Winter. I, I got a recommendation from so many of the Nepali rockers on my YouTube channel who watched my previous videos and I'm really happy and grateful to all of you. Thank you so much for watching my previous you know um videos uh, reaction videos that i made on nepali metal bands and rock bands you know i just really want to explore more i know that i'm quite late in doing that i should have done that probably from last year but nevertheless guys i don't want to uh i just want to keep it going like the way it's going on and it's always gives me an immense pleasure to you know support all the local acts and nepali acts and all the subcontinent artists from you know if you go and check out my playlist i have tried cover, uh, finding metal bands from Northeast India, India, the other parts of India, Pakistan, Bangladesh. You know, I'm always trying to do things here and there just to explore different form of music and it always gives me an immense pleasure to, you know, discover and check out new artists. Makes me really happy. So I was not sure about much about the band, but thankfully I found one uh, article on the band written by someone from Nepal and it's really good that somebody has tried to cover their story it's an it's an amazing feeling so in 2013 that i got to know that the band decided to take a break and per decided to pursue personal things like they focus on their own career and stuff but the band basically was started back in 2002 and you know they're influenced by bands like cradle of filth and when i when i hear the word cradle of filth you know i just i just i just can't tell you anything cradle of filth has always been something a band like i don't know if you guys can see the poster or right over there denny felt uh, the old members the old lineup of cradle of field is still one of the best mem uh, the lineup i ever feel like especially the albums of cruelty and the beast dusk and our embrace principle of evil made flesh those three albums are you know i know very close to my heart you know i love each and every song of all those three albums especially 94 95 96 97 the, the phase you know, uh, I think half of my teenage when I was like 17, 18, 19, I guess, you know, 90% uh, of the time I only grew up listening to Cradle of Field. So I, it kind of makes sense when I hear, listen to the band's history that they grew up listening to Cradle of Field and probably they are much more, uh, you know, experienced and well diversified than what I am because back in 2002, I was literally a baby. And so obviously they know uh, their musical preference and influences and the extensive they have been playing it would be like no wonder they started the band in 2002 their influences are like when they started the band back in 2002 so you can just imagine how extremely fond of metal they would have been back then in 2002 like it's almost 20 plus years back it's an amazing feeling you know and uh, there's a lot of things they have mentioned about their albums and they have a lot of albums they have released and it's, it would be really amazing to check out their songs guys so I'm quite excited. I want to, and I think they have recently released a new, they're back and they have released a new album and that's really an amazing thing. Whoa. I would love to check out their songs and I would expect any of the Antim Grahan fans to let me know what do you guys want me to check out. But this song, I randomly took it up because I think the moment I typed the name in YouTube, the first song that came was Forever Winter. So I was like, okay, let me check this out. So I know I have done, I have, I'm quite late. And probably most of the people, the rockers from Nepal would be laughing at me. But guys, to be honest, you know, um, I I mean, like, it's always better to be late than never, right? So guys, with that note, I'll start the reaction for this song of Antim Grahan. But just want to tell you guys something that, you know, uh, my name is Eddie. I'm from India. I make reaction videos of travel, culture, music and a lot of other things. I'm a big fan of metal music. So please feel free to share any form of metal music. And I also... I love a lot of other things like bands that I grew up listening to like the pop bands or the rock bands So I don't mind doing reaction for any genre especially I mean like I'm fine with everything as long as something I love I love doing it I'm a man of music and culture as what that's what my channel talks about. That's what that's what The agenda of this channel is all about you know trying to understand different, different form of music and different form of culture that exist all across this world So with that note, let's check out this song of Rahan, forever winter and they are from Nepal let's do it guys the 
the vocals oh my god reminds me of Danny Filth man love to see someone doing that back even before I got to know about it I mean like I'm so happy that in Nozus in subcontinent we used to have influences of Cradle of Filth back then oh man amazing <laughs> stop this like oh no there's so many things written here i mean god first of all i would like to tell you that this song has so much of ambience you know that you know that vibe the dark ambience that you need that vibe that raw vintage black metal extreme form of black metal it's so cool and so peaceful to hear man it's so soothing second thing it's low i love the vocals it's like it's you know uh, they have their own texture of screaming and growling and roaring and that's that's so nice you know and i, I can see on the screen that it's mentioned as the fourth album by the Nepal's leading black metal band Tigran comes triumphantly with an awesome production, brutal drumming, and fresh blend of death metal and grindcore. Ah, uh, okay. Alongside with the trademark melodies, a true testimony of perseverance and evolution. KTM rocks for sure, man. So this is basically their uh, fourth album. That's really amazing, man. Wow, nice. I'm so happy that finally I could. come across some extreme form of metal music from nepal i mean like you know i'm always i always love personally when i see a black metal band i always feel happy you know it just touches my soul i mean like i can't even tell you how much i love black metal so it's a great feeling guys <laughs> Hell yeah! I'm so happy that I could check them out, man. I am hoping for sure they should be in Spotify, so I can 
make a playlist of their songs for sure man this is so so good man this is so good always gives me an immense feeling to check out new bands and there's a legendary band since 2002 actually this band reminds me of an indian band called demonic resurrection i have a, i made a recording of demonic resurrection but i'm yet to upload that but i have i'll, I'll soon do that you know because demonic resurrection in india they also started their music scene black metal music back in the early 2000s and since then until today they are still making albums and they've been in a lot of other places all around the world they have performed they are from mumbai they're actually based in mumbai in india so in case if you guys have not checked out demonic resurrection you should check them out you get the same kind of feel but to be honest antim grahan has his own style it's his they have their own you know way of making black metal music and that's really nice because you know getting an uh, influenced and starting a band back in 2002 obviously they will preferably have checked out a lot of more bands than what me or you know my age people have done so far in you know so i do feel their sound reminds me of so many you know uh, artists that i used to listen back then in 2007 like crematory maybe to in some extent opet to some extent maybe um, eternal tears of sorrow i think that was the name of the band that i knew you know kind of those gothic bands and you know there are a lot of influences and that's really nice they have their own unique sign and it's so nice i would i'm so excited to check out their new album also probably i'll do that but what about you guys at the end of the day you tell me guys probably you guys have already seen and know i've seen them live and i would have heard them so what do you guys think about this song or what's your favorite antim grahan song do let me know in the comment section guys also let me know guys what reaction do i do next i will be really grateful to do that so guys i'll be back again soon another reaction from nepal until then guys take care stay safe namaste and stay metal